Have you ever wondered how a new bridge is assembled? Niagara Rigging and Erecting are about to give a textbook lesson. But before we get into the action, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe. A new road extension is expanding the connection of Burlington and Oakville in Ontario, Canada. And part of that expansion crosses over the Bronte Creek West Tributary. NRE needs to erect new steel girders to bridge the gap. All the girders are fabricated slightly different uh, based on the bearing elevations, cross falls for water drainage, and the different slope and profile of the road. Rather than lifting the individual steel girders on their own, NRE is pre-assembling sets in a staging area. At three girders long and two wide, these sets come in at 73 meters long and 175 metric tons. With a span so long and a weight so immense, this is no easy lift, but NRE has a game plan. Utilizing SPMTs, a modular transporter capable of moving massive loads, the sets are shuttled up to the span. Across the gap, a massive crawler crane takes the weight off the far end as the SPMTs roll the set further over the gap. A second crane on the short side picks up the open end and the two cranes work together in tandem to lower the set into its final resting place. We've got a really good crew here. The guys work well together and they're up for the challenge for sure. On our end, we'll use uh, our radios to uh, start with the launch. And for the actual crane, then you guys use your own closed radios to talk to uh, your own personnel back there, right? So we're not confusing the airways with that. The order of operations is critical to the success of these lifts but NRE are perfectionists. But with a target of one set per day, it's time to get to work. Just as planned, the set of girders rolls out over the tributary and the far crane hooks on. Once the set is rolled out further across, the second crane joins the lift, and in tandem, they complete the first installation. Everything went amazing, very good. It was a good process, putting the SPMTs down, coming down here, uh, transferring the load to, into the cranes. It's a smooth process with these guys. One down, three to go. The next day, the crew prepares to launch the second set. the second set in place and the plan being executed to perfection, the crew is now halfway done. We always looking after each other, no? You only not looking for your safety, you're looking for your partner's safety. Everybody wants to go home happy, you know? We are a little family here and try to keep it that way. NRE continues ahead at full speed, launching the third set on the third day. And now, there's just one more lift to go. The crew prepares to wrap this job up efficiently and safely.
I think this is a very remarkable success for NRE. I'm very impressed by the professionalism and also the success how NRE carried out the entire work here. And I truly look forward to work with them again. Primarily with these jobs is they're a challenge, a lot of teamwork and our group works well like that under pressure. And for us, it's a little more exciting than, than most of the ordinary jobs. Good to come out here and show the kids and the family that we, we're doing something for people, you know? This is not for us, this is for everybody. It's uh, something that stays there and you can feel proud of it. Four sets of six girders installed over four days with zero issues. NRE has once again proven their strength of character and dedication to safety. This bridge now has a robust structure ready for decades of future use.